He's lost his greedy mind, poor chap. I want you to take over for his foreign client, this uh, rather eccentric Count Dracula. He's buying up property around London. Of course, sir. I'll attend to the Count. Thank you for your confidence. This is a great opportunity for you, Harker. But you'll have to leave uh, Transylvania immediately. Opportunities such as this come but once in a lifetime. Yes, of course, sir. If I may inquire, what in fact happened to Mr. Renfield in Transylvania? Nothing. Nothing. Personal problems. Close these transactions and your future with this firm is assured. Yes, sir. I will give it my full attention. We've waited this long, haven't we? We can be married when I return. <clears throat> of course. All right. Jonathan. Jonathan, I love you. I love you, Mina. Uh... 30th May, Castle Dracula. I think strange things which I dare not confess to my own soul. The Count. The way he looked at Mina's picture fills me with dread. As if I have a part to play in a story that is not known to me. I didn't hear you come in. Take care how you catch yourself. It is more dangerous than you think. <laughs> A foul bone mends vanity. Perhaps you should grow dear. Diary, 17th September. Poor Jonathan, still so ill, is cheered by the familiar streets of London. For me, now that Lucy is dead, it is a sad homecoming. It is as if a part of me is dead too, except for the tiny hope that lives in me that I will again see my prince. Is he here? Now that I am married, I begin to understand the nature of my feelings for my strange friend, who is always in my thoughts. Jonathan, what is it? It is a man himself. Yeah. Look, he's growing young. Really of your own will and leave some of the happiness you bring. Count Dracula? I am Dracula. And I bid you welcome, Mr. Harko, to my house. Come in. already died, and I never drink wine. An ancestor? I see a resemblance. The Order of the Dracul. The dragon. An ancient society. Pledging my forefathers to 
who defend the church against all enemies of Christ. The relationship was not entirely successful. Oh, yes. <laughs> it is no laughing matter. We, Dracul, have a right to be proud. What devil or witch was ever so great as a killer whose blood flows in these veins? We'll need your strength for the dark days ahead. Mina? Doctor? Yeah? How did Lucy die? Huh? Was she in great pain? Yeah, she was in great pain. Then we cut off her head and drove a stick to her heart and burned it, and then she found peace. Doctor! Please. <laughs> so, Mr. Harker, I must now ask you, as your doctor, a sensitive question. During your infidelity with those creatures, those demonic women, did you for one instant taste of their blood? No. 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 Good. Then you have not infected your blood with the terrible disease that destroyed poor Lucy. <sighs> Doctor, you must understand. I doubted everything. Even my mind. I was... Impotent with fear. I know. But, sir, I know where the bastard sleeps. I brought him there to Carfax Abbey. Vampires do exist. And this one we fight, this one we face, has the strength of 20 or more people. And you can testify for that, Mr. Harker. Uh, Let them go. Our work is finished here. Hers has just begun. 